What is popping today, beautiful people? Welcome back to another episode of Fishing with Flam Man. And honestly, right now, I am kind of mad. Check this out. Look at this. I was on perfect timing. I believe there was a wreck. Um, I've seen um, ambulance and all that driving down here. So I assumed that it was a wreck, but right now I am stuck in traffic, man. Today's video, I am hitting a lake that I've never been to before. And it's actually on my old stomping grounds, man. I went to college in Gaffney, South Carolina, um, played football at Limestone. Shout out to Limestone of Saints, baby. But um, yeah, as the locals call it, Gaffrica. So today we are headed to Gaffrica to do some fishing and fish a smaller body of water. It's a small lake. Um, so yeah, hopefully today's good, man. I got some top water tied on, got my spinning rod, and I got one bait caster. Um, I kind of got an idea of baits that I want to throw as far as like trying to figure out these fish and search baits and things like that. So I only brought three rods with me. I'm not going to overdo it and make it complicated. But today's goal, man, is just to catch fish on a new body of water, man. Do some lake fishing, man. Got the kayak out there in the back. I don't know if you guys can see that. And hopefully the people behind me are subscribing to the YouTube channel as well <laughs> because we are stuck in traffic and they don't have anything else to do. So why not? But that goes for you too. So if you haven't already, you're seeing this video, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and hopefully we can get out of traffic soon, man. I'm gonna stop by QT, um, grab me a little no sugar or sugar-free Red Bull and I don't know, maybe a snack or something. I haven't ate this morning, but I was just so anxious to get out there on the water. That's how it be sometimes, man. So let's go ahead and get into today's video. Let's get it. Well, you guys, we are out here on the water. I honestly probably would have showed you guys a little bit more of the process, but this guy was out here and he was just talking to me and just got sidetracked, man. So we're out here on the water. He told me that people catch him in the back, back here. So I'm gonna pull up the map of this place on my graph just to see where I'm at. I do see some docks and stuff, so I'm probably gonna pitch under some docks and do some things like that. But right now I'm gonna start out with the red chatterbait mini max. I've still yet to catch a fish on this thing, but I think it'll do good in this, these water conditions. So I'm gonna start out with this. Then I got a wacky rig worm tied on and try to skip up under some of these docks and stuff that I see. There's like a pole or something that I'm seeing on the graph. And there's a ton of fish hanging out around that pole. And honestly, the amount of fish is definitely bait fish. Possibly could be crappy. Hopefully, it's a bass or two hanging out around them. And they want something red. Got one. <laughs> Stay down. Ah. First fish. And I'm on that at the mouth of the cove. Something I've been trying to get better at. I've seen people fishing the mouths of the cove. He's staying down good. Fishing the mouth of the cove. And it's right here paid off. Get in here, huh? Ah. Oh my gosh. Yes. It's a big one. Sure, big and that's a big and say big and he's long, long. He's really skinny. Look at this. He has a crazy eye. Somebody he's probably been hooked in the eye before, and yeah, long skinny fish. Let's get a quick picture. Get back to it. Get this guy back. Yeah, long skinny fish. That can be at least a two, two and a half pound if it was all filled out, but probably like a pound, pound and a half. Let's get this girl back. Ah, first one. Look at that. So beautiful, man. So freaking dope. First one, I'm at the mouth of this cove and I'm throwing up shallow on like a little point, man. I'm telling you guys, I'm learning, man. I'm getting better, you guys. I'm getting better. Let's get, let's get back in there. <laughs> okay. 
You want to meet me? You want to go to Greenwood today? I probably won't go today. I'll probably be done yeah. once I leave here, honestly. Really? Yeah, man. I got work tomorrow. <laughs> oh, oh, well, you didn't say that. Yeah. That's tomorrow, though. You still got a whole 24 hours for you guys. Yeah, there, I do, know? but I don't Other like when you when you work six days and only get two days off every week make the most out of it i know i make the most out of it by getting my fishing in in the morning and then i got my whole day to do other things what you trying to do other than fish you a goddamn youtube fishing channel hey i got i got videos right now i'm trying to stay ahead i ain't behind yeah well you you gonna be behind when you don't take that invite to greenwood That's <laughs> Yeah, I just got one. You got him? Yep, got him right now. Right. Oh. I'll let you go. You hear him? You already got him in. He's a little dink. Nah, he digging. He pulling drag. Oh, no, it's a big one. Hold that thought. Hold that thought. Hold that thought. Come here. Oh, my gosh. Come here. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. He's barely hooked. He's barely hooked. Come here. That's what I'm talking about, Ashton. Boy, FaceTime me. Uh, FaceTime me. FaceTime me, dog. Uh, let's see this thing. Whoa, what? <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. Yes, sir. Ooh, hold on, hold that thought. I gotta say the clip, baby. Say the clip. I don't know. What's that? Three? Probably about three, three and a half. Yeah, I'd say that's a three. Man, I was on the phone with Ashton, you guys. Just chopping it up about fishing. Check out this fish. 3.3. I meant 3.5. Three pounds, five ounces. I'm going to put them on the scale again. Just to verify and show you guys. Out here at the new lake, baby. Ah, come on. Clear it out. There you guys go. 3.4, three pounds, four ounces. Let me get a few pictures with this fish. I literally skipped it under a tree and I must've threw it on his head. And he smashed it. Yeah, I threw it under a tree and I must've threw it on his head and he smashed it get some few pictures with this fish and we gonna get it back all right got a few pictures gonna get this beautiful big girl back let's go baby beautiful fish gorgeous fish man ready Look at her. Look at her. Swim off to the depths. Let's freaking go! Oh, that feels good, man. I'm about to get back in there and fish. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Got another one, you guys. Oh my god. It's a good one too. Oh my god. Oh. Hey Siri. Hey FaceTime Ashton. I guess I'd have found them, huh? Huh? I guess so. Nope, shallow. I'm in four feet of water. Oh, no. on, the, on the stick bait? Yeah. Well, 
I guess it just took a phone call for me to change all that, huh? I did. That's what I told my subscribers. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that motherfucker just moved up. Yeah. That's a, what, a three? Probably. They hitting it as soon as it... Like, I don't even have to work it. I'm just throwing it in there, letting it sit. And then when I go to pop it and work it, it get heavy and they already on there. Yeah. They must be just up there waiting on something. Yeah. 211. I'll take okay. that, though. Yeah, all day. I'll take that. Sheesh. We'll catch a bunch more. I'm going to try to, man. I just had to FaceTime you. had to show you. <laughs> Yeah, that's cool, man. I appreciate it. Uh, I'll holler at you. All right, brother. All right. Bye. Yeah. Uh, hang on. There, we go. <laughs> there you go, you guys. This one right here was 211, man. I just FaceTimed my boy Ashton again, but gosh. 211. This about to be my new favorite lake. Let's get this beautiful girl back, too. Oh, look at that, man. Gorgeous freaking fish, dude. Gorgeous fish. Get out of here. And there she goes. Oh man. That feels so freaking amazing, you guys. You guys just don't understand. Whew. I needed all that. Let's keep fishing, man. Man, that one was two pounds and 11 ounces. The first one was three pounds. Or I say the first one. The last one was three pounds and five ounces. And literally, man, I'm just throwing well actually time for another stick bait but i'm literally throwing um if i can get this thing right but i'm literally throwing a stick bait this is the general by berkeley and this is the goat color it's like a green pumpkin natural on one side and it's black and blue on the other side but this one is all beat up as you guys can see but i'm just literally throwing it up shallow i see some sticks hang out out of the water and i guess they're just staged up shallow waiting to feed because like i was telling ashton i'm not even working it i'm literally throwing it in there and then when i go to work it it's one already on so <sighs> they're eating it they want it that's all that matters to me man i'm gonna have to get another stick bait this one is all tore up yeah put that guy right there and grab another one and we just gonna keep fishing this stretch i'm about to mark on my graph but when i come back here i know exactly where to come but yeah man <laughs> brand new lake figuring it out man I, i'm honestly this honestly makes me happy it makes my day because i'm literally becoming a better angler i'm getting better at recognizing when to cast and what to cast and all that so oh uh, man this really makes me excited so but anyways, let's just get back to fishing and see what else we can get. Oh, got a good one. Got another good one, you guys. Got another good one. These fish in here are good, dude. Oh. oh my gosh, it's a freaking tank. It's another tank. This is another tank. Oh. This is another tank. Oh, no. Come on. Another tank. Oh my god. Like, oh my. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is another tank. Oh my god. This might be my PB. This might be my PB. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Oh, he's skin hook. He's skin hook. He's skin hook. Oh my gosh. Oh. WTF. WTF. Look at this, you guys. Skin hook, bro. Skin hook. Dude, this might be my PB. This might be my PB, you guys. This might be my PB. It's not my PB. 
four pounds, six ounces. That's almost a four and a half pounder, you guys. Oh my goodness. Oh my God, I am on fire. I am on fire right now. I am on fire. <sighs> I'm freaking shaking, you guys. I'm gonna get this girl back. That is a massive fish. Massive fish. Oh, let's get this girl back. Oh my gosh. I was just about to call her today. Oh my gosh. Thank you for playing, beautiful girl. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh my gosh. I don't even know what to say, you guys. Hold on. Let me flip the camera on. I'm going to be honest, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. Wrap this video up. I'm going to call it a day. I caught four fish. I caught a four pounder, four and a half pounder. Caught a three pounder and caught a two pounder and probably caught like a one pounder, man. And I just been fishing shallow, throwing a worm up shallow, stick bait, um, skipping under overhanging trees. And oh my gosh, the fish keep getting bigger and bigger. But I was literally making my way in. So I am going to end it on this note. Thank you guys for tuning in to another episode, man. Fishing these small bodies of lake on my kayak, man. I hope you guys enjoy. This is only a glimpse of what you guys should be expecting this summer, man. Appreciate you guys for tuning in. And I'm out. Peace.